Hello, this is Michelle Knight. This is your weekly astrology for the week starting the 20th of November 2017. This week, Neptune is finally going direct. So expect a lot more clarity and vision to come into your life. Here's your weekly astrology. Leo, this week. Oh my goodness, there's a whole mood change for you. Yeah, baby! It's all kicking off. You're feeling excited. You're feeling optimistic, creative, lusty, sensual, and connected to people. People love being around you this week. You've been feeling a bit meh or a bit down. All of that can change as you kind of got your game back on. Your mane is all fluffy. You know, you're painting your claws and you're hitting the town. Well, that's what you should do anyway. Or whatever it is that floats your boat makes you feel creative, makes you feel empowered, makes you feel like the wild woman within. That is the energy of this week. Firstly, I have to say that Venus is sextile Pluto, and that's all about you maybe staying in and cutching up and doing healthy things at the beginning of the week. And that kind of uplifts your vibe and could bring some unexpected passion into your life. I don't know how, but that's what I'm seeing here as we have Venus in your position of your home and family and Pluto still in your position of sorting your stuff out. I mean, you know, hopefully you've learned by now that this is a time in your life where you have to deal with the details and take care of yourself. Anyway, forget about that boring stuff. Now let's get down to the nitty gritty. And that is that the sun, your ruler, is shifting signs and going into the one of the best placements of the year for you. He is going into your sensuality, soulmate, children, playfulness, joy zone. So you are rebooted and you are uplifted by that energy. And there's an aura of positivity around you that other people feel. On top of that, Mercury, the planet of communication, is trying Uranus, the wacky one, the eccentric one, the bringer of surprises, the genius, in your position of travel, in your position of learning and eccentricity. So there's an unexpected conversation coming up this month, uh, this month, this week, in fact, on the 25th, that, that kind of shifts things for you. Maybe somebody's or maybe a love interest you're going to meet who's from overseas or different or unusual in some way or perhaps you're going to go on a journey with a lover or you're plotting or planning something but it's out of the blue so that's good news neptune's going direct this is quite good for you you may have been pondering or dealing with spiritual angst from the past maybe shadowy stuff maybe things that hurt you in the past and you couldn't put your finger on it it's like an sort of just a feeling around you that the past was haunting you in some way happy days Neptune's going direct and you are feeling more magical, more sensual and more powerful. Take care, gorgeous, and I'll speak to you soon. Hello, wonderful one. Thank you so much for listening. It would be fabulous if you liked, subscribed or shared. It would be really, really helpful. Also, I have a ton of free stuff for you horoscope.co.uk for everything astrology and michellenight.com for everything psychic and free tarot reading. See you there.